Hello friends, I'm Vaidehi and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to talk about injections. Injections are a common way to deliver medicine and fluids into the body. They can be a bit scary, but when done correctly, they are very safe. Injections are important because they allow the medicine to reach your body quickly. They bypass your digestive system, which means the medicine starts working faster. Injections are also helpful when someone cannot take medicine by mouth, like when they are sick or unconscious. In the next part, we will talk about how injections work and what happens when you get an injection. Stay tuned! Injections work by delivering medicine directly into your body. A needle is used to put the medicine under your skin, into your muscles, or directly into your bloodstream. The location of the injection depends on the type of medicine and how quickly it needs to work. Many factors affect how well your body absorbs the medicine. These include the type of injection, the location of the injection, and the person's body. For example, injections into muscles are absorbed faster than injections under the skin. Now that we understand how injections work, let's move on to some potential complications that can arise. While injections are generally safe, there are some potential complications. These include pain, swelling, or redness at the injection site. These are usually mild and go away on their own. More serious complications, such as infection or an allergic reaction, are rare. It's important to tell your doctor if you notice any unusual symptoms after an injection. In the next part, we will discuss the different types of medicines and fluids that can be given through injections. Many types of medicines and fluids can be given through injections. These include vaccines, antibiotics, and pain relievers. Injections can also be used to give fluids and nutrients to people who cannot eat or drink. The type of injection you receive will depend on your specific medical needs. It's important to talk to your doctor about any concerns you have about injections. That's all for today's video. I hope you found this information helpful. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel for more informative videos. See you next time. Gap2S.